Gentlemen, if we may divert for a moment, I'll just ask you to bow your heads. I want to pray to light-skinned basketball Jesus for, for our man, Ben Simmons. <laughs> God, please help Ben. He's getting a beautiful bag. God, you know I deal in memes and chicanery. I do not want to clown or pack this man up. Light-skinned basketball Jesus, amen. 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 What's up? This is Out of Pocket, the hoop show for real hoop fans. I'm the Jethro Jenkins. I'm Josiah Johnson. I'm Zach Schwartz. The basketball season officially starts now. Football's done. All star break is done. Right? No one's been paying Zach, attention. What you saying? We have. Basketball. What are you talking about? <laughs> Listen, we're paid boys, to pay our numbers, <laughs> our numbers go way up once football's that's done. A fact, right? That's a fact. We that's a fact. That's a fact. My numbers stay consistent fact. because I go get the football back. That's, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Go Smart get exactly. man. Smart man. All star break's done. Now we can really focus and. I think our team might not be making the playoffs, but we'll get to that. Our team who? The Lakers. The Lakers. You a Clippers fan again? (laughs) We get into all that. You a Clippers fan again? You a Clippers fan again? Right. (laughs) Ladies and gentlemen, we saw that game against the Pelicans. They were locked in. (laughs) That was probably one of the best games I've seen the Lakers play, where they actually smacked a team, did not trick the lead off. That you know going into that fourth quarter. Right. That 20 did not feel. LeBron got to just not play much of that fourth. This is the roster the Lakers should have had this season, like from a construction standpoint and the bodies and everything. I think it's well set up. I just, they haven't been stringing enough wins together that I fear. But we have momentum now going into All-Star weekend. They're three games out of being an eighth, right? Is that where they're at right now? Yeah, Am I tripping? But it's like, it's three games, but they need to win three and then have the somebody other Somebody else has to like lose, lose three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, like yeah somebody's yeah. going to fumble the back, and it's not going to be Rob Palenka. I, Rob. Think, I think the Blazers are are screwed. I think there's a lot of teams that are screwed up ahead of them, but we'll see. Rob and Jeannie, you got a lot of slander, okay? Not for me. Jeannie, because you know I rock with you. I rock with Jay Moore as well. <laughs> Jerry Maguire, one of my favorite movies. Trade uh, deadline has come. Trade and- deadline, Rob is back. <laughs> yeah. But the trade deadline has come and gone. And I want to know who are your top three teams going to the second half of the season? So we had a meeting yesterday and I lied on the document. Okay, 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 oh, okay. Lied. It was before the Pelicans game. Okay. Though, so I got to put the. <laughs> I, I just, I, you know, last year I was lying to myself. I didn't think the Lakers could really do it. I just said it to, you know, pander to the Lakers nation. But I really feel like this squad, after what they showed me against the Zion, this Pelican squad. Yeah. LeBron cooking, several days removed from the foot injury, been turning up, every Yana over here, getting it in, drinking Lobos. <laughs> Only played 30 minutes. He fucked up my underdog pick him. It's okay, bro. But AD did not. And he was out there cooking as well. So I would say if we have to talk like the square teams, yeah, we got to go the Celtics, the Bucks, and the Nuggets. Mm-hmm. I think the Celtics not having Tatum and Jalen Brown taking the Bucks to overtime. Jeez. <laughs> Jeez. Concerning. A little concerning. <laughs> a little concerning indeed. <laughs> Milwaukee is, but it's just one game, so it's not a big deal. And then my, my dark horse in the, the Western Conference, the Los Angeles Lakers. Mm. We cannot throw the towel on them. You've seen it. They're locked in. That first quarter was some of the best Lakers, bas- like just throwing lobs to AD, utilizing him correctly. Fine, the man, man wasn't just standing on the court running up and down, looking like a bum, looking like me in a rec league. He was out there really getting it. And even we had Lonnie Walker on the show. Lonnie's having career-high numbers. Yeah. Lonnie's not even playing that much. He didn't play that much in the Pelicans game. But I think he's a guy now when you have that type of, you know, ammunition where a guy like that you know, didn't get into like late in the fourth quarter. But even he's available to now to go cook. He's going to get a chip on his shoulder. Hopefully not puke on the court again like he did with Duncan. Oh, shit. Really go puke some threes. And they got the Warriors coming out of All-Star break. It's going to be so exciting, Zach, because if we smack oh, them twice, my. we smack them they, twice, oh, that pack is going up. I hope they beat the shit out of the Warriors. <laughs> Who's yours? I think the Celtics, Bucks, and Suns. I like the Celtics. Celtics are the oh, best team in the KD. league. Yeah, you know what right, I mean? Right. Yo, you, oh, come on. Yeah, how you forget KD? <laughs> oh, I forgot Kevin Durant. You know what I mean? But I, I think that the thing with them, I think the Nuggets are still a great team, but they just haven't proved anything to me. They didn't you know what do I'm anything at the deadline. Yeah. Every team that wants to contend short of the Celtics is like doing crazy shit at the deadline. They just said they were the, comfortable. They liked what they had. I mean, they, they even should. gave they up. The finals last year. I, I, I get it, but they gave up uh, They gave up Bones, which I think like is oh, a yeah, great yeah, off the bench, too. That's 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 a big loss to me off the bench. You know what I mean? I agree. 14, I, I'm in the Celtics. Oh, okay, I meant the Celtics. Okay, okay, didn't okay. do it. Uh, didn't need to do anything. Yeah, for but sure. For the, sure. The, they got Mississippi Muscala though. Yes. Yeah. Who the Lakers once traded Great for? Movie. And didn't do shit. But, but Mike's been solid. Is, I mean, I, I, I yeah, talked a little shit about him earlier in the season. He's had a, a decent season, bro. Yeah. He's a solid. Yeah. Though, you know yeah. yeah. I mean. Chuck, yeah, yeah, Chuck's yeah. shaking his head because he's watched him on the Clippers too. Whatever. Decent on OKC. Decent on OKC though. Mine was Celtics. Suns and Clippers. So yeah, before yeah. All-Star, right, there was it's been talked about that Russ might sign with the Clippers yeah. and the Clippers want to talk to him. And if you're Russ, go there. For sure, go there. Stick it to Lakers fans. Stick it to the LeBron fans that were so rude to you. 
Stick it to them. Why, wait, why do LeBron fans get this slander? Why, I think was, this I was think, general Laker hatred, no, bro. The, uh, the entire is, media, like everybody, was on were, Russ's I ass. That, I don't think yeah. it was bigger than LeBron, LeBron fans supported kinda, Russ. It was, it was crazy, bro. The, yeah, where do we think that vampire comes uh, from? Where do we think a lot of the like, from the same place that everything comes from, the hills of Caucasia, <laughs> the hills of Caucasia. <laughs> and I love Dave McMenamin. He's a legend, good friend of mine. Mm. Let me just explain like this. Maybe he misconstrued that vampire comment. So Russ sucks the blood out of the Lakers, right? He's a crip. He's going to suck the blood out of the Lakers. That's some real crip shit. Nigga, what? That was, <laughs> it's like my Kyrie cryptic one. It's like my Kyrie cryptic. Consensus, we all- I don't want no blood in here. We all have the Celtics in here. You had you had the Suns, I had the Suns. You were like, yeah. oh, Suns all- I said know, butt nuggets, but- third. Third, probably. For me, the Nuggets are the team like that is going to get cooked at some point. Like we saw it in the bubble; they were supposed to beat the Lakers. Dwight Howard came in, Debo Joker. Also, they just said like Murray is he going to be healthy? You know, what I'm saying hopefully, right? MPJ, yeah. you know, struggles with that as well. Two strays. I, I, from, I question from, that. From Arthur you know and mean? Bones Highland. <laughs> Do you think the Suns are the team to beat in the West now? More than the Nuggets. I think allegedly, but just the way that that squad is like the Clippers, but just like you know, it's like the Southwest Clippers. I. <laughs> Oh, Chuck. I'm, I'm just so saying. Sorry. And that's not slander. I, I, I can't. Uh, bro, not, not with KD and Booker on the squad. That's what you I mean, think don't it? say bro. Booker. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, no, Bo I mean, Booker, Booker is a. Booker was very much. Booker, Booker is was, now a number two on that team. Booker as a number two is an incredible there fucking two individuals, number two. There are two individuals. He's number two flying. now. KD's one. KD is fucking one. Are you kidding me? There it's Kevin Durant. Flying KD is one. Devin Booker is new age light skinned. You're not just accepting that. Come on, he'll be all right. There were two individuals flying the plane when they flamed out against the Mavs. Okay. Devin Booker and Chris Paul. And That's they're all still on that squad. I don't, but the thing is, too, they only okay. have like 15 or 20 games to play together because KD's not playing right now. But KD fits in so easily. That's oh, the thing about him. He's so he's efficient. Awesome. You know I'm what I'm saying? I think it'll be I fun to watch. I think it makes him, you know what I'm saying, number one in the West. And after losing that game seven last year, it's one thing, right? If it's the fourth quarter and we're still nervous. Like, I was getting heat off in the first quarter because I knew that there was no way this shit was going like, <laughs> to. Come back. I've just never had that feeling before in a game seven with the, you know, the oh, favorite the team just getting old, smacked getting like that. Cooked. Like, early. Getting, I love that getting meme. the lost memes out in the first quarter, Zach, that's unheard of. I have morals. I, have <laughs> I love that meme <laughs> of Chris Paul hits a big three to cut the lead to 42. <laughs> you think One that happens with KD, though? You no. Can, uh, no way. There's not a, no way. No, no way. No way. Yeah. So. I think KD rejuvenates. Obviously, we were, we were both out there for, for Super Bowl week. Very spacious. I think that that spaciousness, though, is going to get to him. Everything is too far spread out. All right? You got to consolidate, Phoenix. Consolidate. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> that city's so far. They said Scottsdale. Out. It was North Scottsdale. I didn't know what that meant. Zach. Oh, it's so far. That, it's, everything's so spread out. I thought the Uber drivers, if they wanted to end my life, they could have like, taken you Ample desert, options to bury me. Yeah, you're doing? in the dark out there. <laughs> no Filibertos. There was nothing cracking. <laughs> the what is Filiberto? What is that? I've never been to Phoenix. Baller. Oh, you like it? Colon cleanser. Oh, it is. But you're so ASU guys. Zach. Gross. I How many hate times it. have you had it? I'm a, I'm a, I'm an out of counter. Too many times. I've gotten sick too many times. I'm once every like six years. John caught me once at Yahoo getting sick, and he said that it sounded like I was playing trumpet. Oh, yeah. A lot yeah. of trumpet time. Shrimp day? <laughs> so like Miles Davis in that motherfucker. You feel uh, me going crazy? Yeah, we don't, <laughs> we talked we about don't that. need to go into this. We did <laughs> shit talk. We talk about that, and I tried to do the green shrimp, but I don't think them dudes was washing their hands adequately, so I take it back. So much of the food there was so bad. But anyway. I want to ask you this. Who's your dream matchup in the West? So, last year, you know, Clay was still injured. He came back. Amazing season. I tweeted in jest lightly that, you know, I'm, I hope that Clay and Steph could be healthy so the Lakers could beat them in five. Warriors fans, you know, known for being sensitive, known for being in their feelings, brought that tweet back up, but only after they won the championship, which already tells me, like Michael Jordan said, you know, if you're not talking shit when you're down, don't talk shit after the, it's already been decided. That's not, you know what I mean? But that's worth it. Yeah. But P-Lo, honorable man, packed me up. <laughs> uh, the one, one dweeb boy, the dweeb boy, I forget his name, but he was telling Where's everybody, world? apologize. No, where's was my uh, guy? Yeah. I know y'all have, you guys have B. We're going, we're going. You know, I don't know that nigga world like world. that. I don't yeah. care. I think y'all would all <laughs> like each other. With non-Warriors, LeBron, yeah, the latest stuff. Y'all just hanging out at a barbecue. I wish the best. Checking. But, you know, oh, they were all flexing. <laughs> So I would love to see the Warriors and the Lakers meet in the play-in, uh, similar to the last time they were playing when, when LeBron won that series, dotted Steph's eye, couldn't see right, if we remember. Mm -hmm. Blind, <laughs> and made sure everyone knew how blind he was. So won that series, really helped close the gap. I think he's leading in the non-KD year, so, you know. But. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, mine, I want Clippers Nuggets, and let me explain why. 
there is there's a certain player on that Clippers team that I'm a huge fan of. His oh, name's man. Bones Highland. Let's fucking go. And I want to watch him burn that Nuggets team to the ground. I think <sighs> seeing him stare down Jamal Murray, dot one right in his fucking eye, will be glorious. And and as someone who's obviously we're biased because we were huge Big Bones fans, fans Bones, here, yeah. and he's just such a good dude. I just thought it was stupid of them. I thought they got genuinely worse by letting him go. And I think that the story of him getting to go in there and shell them is awesome. So I think he was cooking Murray in practice. I do too. I could see Bones shifty ass cooking him yeah. and letting him know and what that he laughing. was cooking his ass too. Like, I'm baking you, my boy. I can hear That's Bones. the only reason because everybody else seemed to love Bones. You know what I'm saying? The fans, the, you the, can fans, tell the fans loved him. Sad. My mom, you know what I'm saying? She was saying, like, I wanted to go, I wanted to go to a Nuggets game to, to see him. Bones and Joker. Those are the two players. You know what I'm saying? Man, and I so, want to watch Bones. I mean, I love Joker, but I mean, but I, 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 I'm, I'm I think Joker's be, game is fun. People talk it's, about it's this. It's enjoyable, but I'm gonna be more entertained watching. Bones. Bones got that, yeah, yeah, for sure. With the look away, yeah. <laughs> and he's shifty as fuck, fuck, fuck. You know, he brings good energy. You know, so I think that's what happened with uh, that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? But yeah, I would love he's to see that. He's an all-conditioned cool. shit talker, though, right? Like he's gonna talk shit. If no matter, up, if no matter down, what, no he matter might what. My fifth, I'm gonna beat your ass the next time. And know how good you are, or how high you are. Like you a superstar, it don't matter to him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He letting everybody know what time it is. And I you respect feel me. That. So I think Mavs Suns, because I just want to see. Do you like, want them to run that? Back? I want, I want them to run it back. But I think the Mavs would get baked. They can't stop a fucking. Soul, no. dog. But it would be an offensive. The, the layers to that is and so the, fun. No, and the Mavs, have you seen them? Look, like they, they look, dude, Kyrie went, was it like two games ago? 26. Oh Kyrie God, had ins on. went insane Kawhi. in the fourth quarter. Still lost because they can't yeah. stop anybody, bro. He's crazy. It's an offensive that, league. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that shot that he hit on Kawhi. Where Kawhi fully blocked it and he still pulled it back and flipped great it. Great bro. There were so many shots where he was getting contested well, like great defense. Mm -hmm. But he's just, still you know scored. what I'm saying, full Kyrie. So you know I think the I mean? layers of it are so fun. So you have yeah. the rematch of Luka Lafayette yeah. book. Then you also have Kyrie playing against KD. It's 4-0, though. There's it's, so much. It's 4-0, though. You think? It's, 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 a, it's, a, it's, it's a sweet, baby. Right, what, if West, what if Westbrook goes to the Mavs? Oh my god! Then they still have no defense. They, then they still have no defense. They need defense, bro. But that I'm, I'm using them in a Pat Bev no role. No ball defense at all. Take these niggas out. <laughs> Just dive at knees. Bulldog. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Pitbull. So, oh, Pat Bev. You think? So you think Mavs are not a championship contender? Not at all, bro. Not, like not at all. Not at Suns, all. Do I don't think, think not, not even close to the Suns. No way, bro. I think, think they're gonna get cooked we, in the we've playoffs. We've seen it last they year. The, they can't, bro. Bro, they can't stop a soul. They have no defense. They got worse on defense. And I think as a, they look better on paper with Kyrie. But I think as a team, they don't gel as well. They haven't figured it out. They're gonna both have to be playing. The best basketball they can just to win games. Yeah, they're both averaging because they have 30. nobody else on the squad. They're both you know averaging saying? thirty, but they're zero two. And they're small as fuck. You know what I'm saying? They're, they're, oh, trying, they're playing Javale McGee trying to get some size, bro. Those years are gone, bro. Javale ain't Javale no more, dog. <laughs> Javel, Kenny Javale, Javel, Javel, we saw with the Lakers, bro. Yeah. And, I, and I love Javale. No Javale not, slander. Bro, I'm not trying to sit on Javale. I'm just Black saying. History Month. Save <laughs> <laughs> it for March first. <laughs> he he likes for halfway you know, through. You know what I mean? <laughs> but, yeah, Canadian light skins. I don't know what's going on. Anymore. No, man. But yeah, I, I don't. I just don't see him doing nothing, bro. I mean, they'll be. Fun basketball? Will it be winning basketball? I don't see it. Jason Kidd has a lot he has to figure out. I think I oh. don't envy him having to figure out how to make this work. I think the bigger question I have to you guys is, is Kyrie still on this team next year? <laughs> I don't see it. I see a team that Kyrie can go to. <laughs> oh my, I knew. We already know I, where it's going. I like this but I, I don't think he's up. off. I don't think I don't think he's I don't think he's Kyrie, he's a, he's an interesting guy. We got Topanga Canyon, we got Melrose. <laughs> we got places Kyrie. Lots to offer. Is, a lot to offer. My fear is he'll go up to Panga Canyon and never they come never down. Come back <laughs> never down. come down. But yeah, it's an interesting thing to see that they would give up all those assets just to get Kyrie on loan. It's not like this makes him like the premier championship contender. Maybe a little bit more before the KD trade. Mm -hmm. But once that trade happened, it's like, ugh, like even the Lakers shit, I was excited as shit. I, I went to bed with a Woody, then woke up, <laughs> saw the KD nose, flaccid. <laughs> flaccid. <What? laughs> I guess we talked a lot about the West. Is Should John Morant, who told everyone that this was his West now, should he be worried? I think he should be. I think they're like, I'm not scared of that team. I think that Grizzlies team, there's too much. This is all I'll say. We had that laser discussion, and I've really been thinking about it. I really had to do it. <laughs> oh, my God. I really dig deep. I, I low-key forgot about that I did, too. <laughs> like, niggas, learn how to aim? What the fuck you need lasers for? Wind-aided, performance enhancers? What are we doing? 
You don't need a laser if you know how to aim. Don't aim at me, though. <laughs> Jesus oh, Christ. What is going to kill the Grizzlies? And I'm going to put the, the Shannon Sharp cardigan on. No, that shit is blocking all bullets. That shit like a motherfucking bulletproof vest. Thick-ass no. cardigan. But you notice that we did this whole show, and not once did any of us think about the Grizzlies. And that's no. what, that was my exact no point, one, bro. We've been talking for 20 minutes, haven't said anything about the Grizzlies, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like... I th they're they're fun. They're fun. They're fun. You know what yeah. I mean? They'll still be exciting. They're a young team. They'll be good in the future. Time was, is it now? Was though. my matchup I put down Grizzlies Warriors? Was that the one I put down on there? I can't even remember. You put Clippers Nuggets. No, I put Clippers <laughs> Nuggets. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I already yeah. talked about. It. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, my brain is still in Glendale somewhere. I had, I had too much to drink hey, this weekend. Where the weekend. fuck is Glendale in proximity to Phoenix and all? Yeah, far. Arizona, your shit is too vast, dog. It's spread out too far, but it's like it's like driving from LA to Long Beach, and that's just in Scottsdale. Yes, for real. Yeah, I haven't left Scottsdale yet. That's how no, far. it's like There's that. No Dallas, Texas, bro. There's no traffic. Twenty minutes to the fucking grocery store. That's nigga. Twenty similar. minutes to the gas station. You can't do shit. You know what I'm saying? It's not well set up. Anyway, but it is what it is. Sorry, yeah. about that. So you think? I just, I don't think, I think the Grizzlies are not that well constructed. I don't think they got better at the deadline. And I don't think anyone really is afraid of them. They got hoed by Shannon Sharp. You got hoed by Shannon Sharp. They <laughs> lost that game too, didn't they? Yeah, the Lakers came back. Yeah, the Lakers came back. And forth. They were cooking the Lakers. I've like, seen it, Zach, with my uh, own eyes. I think the Grizzlies are closer to being dissolved and everyone's getting sent out than they are to winning a title. But, okay, they're, they're a really young team. I agree. Two years from now, what does the league look like? And those players are going to be really good then. I you know agree. what I'm saying? So why, I just I, think, I just, why would I you dissolve that squad at this point? And yeah. I think that when you are building a team, you need to see the trajectory keep going. I don't think they should dissolve it. I think that teams just panic, though. Like, I have a fear that if you're the Grizzlies, you're like, oh, well, we could get this player in the building. We got to send Desmond Bain out. Or The Grizzlies you know, aren't a win-now franchise, though. You know what I'm saying? No. Like, you know, I, like no. what they've been they, doing is probably they, surprising the fuck. I feel like they th in, if you're a Grizzlies fan, in your brain, you didn't get a ring from Crit and Grind. You held that core together as long as you could and then had to completely rebuild. Aren't you a little afraid that that's going to happen again? That, that the best version of this team is like, oh, you make it to the Western Conference Finals and then... I think that's okay for that franchise, though, if that's oh, the best version of the team. Fair. You know what I'm saying? A team that fair. they what they knocked off the Spurs. You know what I'm saying? They beat some really good squads, yep. made deep into the playoffs, and we're contenders, you know, to a degree. You know what I mean? But I think that's fine for that franchise. Okay. You know what I mean? And I think, you know, at some point, I think that if the, this team is will be good enough to win a chip. You know what I'm saying? They have some really good young pieces. No, that's a good point. As the, the greats, the greats that they're playing now kind of, you know, start to slow down, slow down a little bit. You Bro, if I'm me? the Grizzlies, I'm not feeling the Josh shit. And I'm going to punish Ja. You know, I'm going to tell Ja. Oh like, Ja, you know what, Ja? Boy, this is I don't away. appreciate all this shit. You know, I'm going to send you. I'm going to send you to a spot where your dad got hoed <laughs> by a man in a blue cardigan. None other than the Los Angeles Lakers. We have assets for you, Ja. Come on to LA. We got stricter gun laws, though. <laughs> we do not have assets. Stricter gun laws. Unless, <laughs> unless they want to, in the, we got they want to lightly. Build. A lightly used Anthony Stopper. Davis in a 2030 draft pick. We're not getting... Yeah, if they didn't trade AD for KD, that was kind of like my ooh. But, the hope. But AD's been playing good, so... Wasn't there a statement out that like LeBron's getting frustrated with AD? Did I see that, or was that a fake quote? Was that a real one? The Hills Sorry. of Caucasia. I saw someone made a TikTok, and I didn't... I should have looked it up. I didn't see that. The Hills of Caucasia. Was he frustrated in the sense that... Because KD's been having... I mean, AD's been having a great season. Was he frustrated in the sense that he's tired of him not being available? Like, Could for be. big chunks? I just think that, like, as, as the ship starts to take on water, you look at throwing someone over so it doesn't sink so fast, and there's a large seven-foot gentleman that's real nice to throw he's out of the a boat. He's season, man. He's, he's playing well. really, really, really good basketball. It was Colin Cowherd. I can't that, trust that uh, shit. I don't trust that. His camp have been frustrated by the how many minutes he has played. They I understand that. Anthony Davis. They are also mad that Darvinham is not keeping the pressure on Anthony Davis. I talked to the NBA source, who I've known for a long time. He said the Dallas Mavericks and Anthony Davis keep your eye on. Them. Oh, so to Kyrie for eighty? That is not mm. no, but they, Anthony Davis is pouting. LeBron's holding him because you saw the shot of it. You saw the shot of Anthony Davis when LeBron broke the record. Oh, that was bro, like, and then and then the lie after that followed. That was just the worst lie I've what did ever he say heard in my after? entire life. He said he didn't know. There was literally a fucking ticker. <laughs> There he was a ticker. Every locked in the white. He was on the bench, my nigga. Like every <laughs> everybody. Dude, dude, look. He don't have their phone out, bro. My lady wasn't even watching the fucking game, and by my reaction, she knew. Oh, he broke the record. It's yes. time to pop the fucking bottle. You know what I'm saying? Like, he said, "Fuck that record." What about our record? He didn't know. He I didn't know. I was just really caring. Caring, caring about winning. You had like what 13 fucking points. But that's the problem, and they got. 
smacked by the thunder on the second night of I a I think back winning back. can fix a lot of this stuff. He didn't try. It's weird that you're not Le- trying. LeBron was not giving up the rock. Understandable. But LeBron was cooking. That nigga yeah. wasn't like he wasn't. Bro, he was bringing that ass back. They was down like 10 and he would if come I'm back. If I'm AD, and though, and, and I saw LeBron walking with that fit and I saw Jay Z, and I, oh, wait, this is the upper the, left. At upper the level point when he, hit the game, when, he, when he tied, the, when, he, when he broke the record or whatever, right? They were down, what, three? Four? Mm. Nigga, was it against- they right in the game. I need yeah. my touches. Hey, hey, but, hey what I was about that game is fucking Shay, dog. I don't see Shay as much as I, you know, because he's not on national television. Yeah. Right, you want to see Shay, you got to go to Applebee's you, in you, fucking you, Oklahoma City. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> right, right. They're not putting the thunder it's on they put, But dog, he gets to his spots so easily. You know exactly where he gets buckets, and it's but it's impossible to keep him from those spots. It's He makes the game so much easier. You know what I'm saying? They like, had, so they'll get Chet next year. And they add they're not going to be good. Top I don't. What do you think about Chet? What do you, I, bro, we have not mentioned Chet. He hasn't played. He's I, I, I know, but like he's just straight up forgotten. I saw a video oh, of Chet. Yeah. I saw a video of Chet of him like, you know, in, in the here getting the grind. You know, they 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 don't believe in me. I, you know, one of those videos and shit, motivation videos. And I was like, <laughs> damn, I forgot you existed, my nigga. And I, hope, I saw you in the summer. I hope that we nigga's eating biscuits. <laughs> I forgot he was a human being. To the room, I asked, did we forget about Embiid? When he got stabbed no, for a year. bro, no. Trust the process. We was thinking about we, was, and the people were talking we were about, about him like, back in the day. That's because it was a Philly. different time period. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Chet Holmgren know. has Negro tendencies. Time will tell. Is Bucks Celtics a given for the Eastern Conference Finals, or do you think there's any other East team that will slip in there? <laughs> no, like, is there any other well, question? I thought, well, I you thought. I mean? I mean, I thought the. Ca- I honestly was like, oh, maybe the Cavs good, but then they get. Like, where are they better than the Bucks? Love. Where do the Cavs the play? Oh, no. Where they, do the they, Cavs play? Play? Where do they play? Where do they play? <laughs> in, <laughs> in Cleveland. In Cleveland. That's wrong with LeBron there. Oh, oh, yeah. they fucking not gonna beat the Bucks. They're a good basketball team. Yeah, I like watching them play. They got some really good pieces, bro. But the Bucks and Celtics. Or like, bro, it's a big drop off at third. You know what I'm saying? Knicks, I think no. Come like, on, bro. Giannis is at a level right Come now. Up. No. What was the point of that? <laughs> like, everybody loves Knicks, 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 John. Right, I guess. Right, yeah. that works. Knicks fans, we rock with you guys. Yeah. All right, yeah. okay, Knicks. For... Why is everybody always talking about us? Because you're in the fucking largest market in the country, Have dickheads. To. What the Have fuck do you to. think? The fuck you mean? Fuck, it smells like pee pee out there though. I will stand on that. I love New York. And your cigarettes are overpriced. Not that I buy them. I'm just saying. Why I see twenty two dollars cigarettes, eighteen dollar uh. eggs. What are y'all doing? And your cribs are small. Yeah, come on out to L A. Right, San Fernando Valley. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't think. Look, Buck Celtics. If they both stay healthy, I think Giannis and Blee. Everybody loves Joker. He's probably going to three peat because he got the MVP, complexion yeah. for affection. Okay. <laughs> but what Giannis is doing out there. I don't care what they're gonna do. They're gonna pack. They've already packed me up. Dude. No, no, it's just I'm, funny. I'm, just bro, I'm, up. I'm just. I'm, I'm amazed. That wasn't. That was have beautiful. Smooth. Oh, smooth. Right, as well. right. right. I'm old and washed. I, I've started reading books again. I'm out here. There we go. Lifetime Let's Network. Go. I loved it. I've been watching Damn. Last of Us first two episodes. I told my wife hey, I don't hey. want to watch this shit no the more. The first really? episode whooped my ass. Yeah. The third episode is the most beautiful episode of television. Nigga crying and shit. Huh? No, I didn't see it. No, but PlayStation. What was it on? I'm watching. I was Grand Theft Auto. That was the last, Bro, last was, you saw me on, on any I platform. Like, t- it's the best game I've ever played. My, my, Garda Basio has a friend that worked on it. Yeah. And, he, and Garda had just had a kid when it dropped. <clears throat> he said, I love you. Do not play that game. Because as a parent oh, at that time, because like, of the shit that be going on, it's like, don't. Uh, but though, that, that's the Hey, when he did. As, y'all, y'all caught up? I, I yeah, watched. Yeah. I watched it. Yeah, yeah. Spoiler alert. Go ahead. I'm just saying, niggas, niggas out here getting my emotions all ripe in. We got the kid, you know, sign language and all that good shit. <laughs> oh, we talking about fourth episode. But soon, oh, soon as soon as she, she she tapped out and woke up and saw the like, oh, nigga out. You, know, you already knew what time it was. He was chilling. He was chilling on the he TV was, show. He was too posted, bro. <laughs> you got to be half dead to post like that. He was too. He was no, chilling too hard. In at first, I'm like mushrooms. Like you know, what I'm saying like, what is this Coachella? Oh, what are we doing? I don't know. <laughs> like got caught up in the sunrise. You seen Will Smith no. do this shit with the other weirdos that I really got my mind fixated on. Bro. But that's neither here nor there. Back to Buck Celtics. <laughs> Giannis is that dude. Like, I saw Giannis. So AD packed up Giannis in Milwaukee, but I knew Giannis was going to come to LA and be like, nay, my brother, in Greek, Greco Nigerian legend. Hmm. 40 piece. Whenever he feels like the man will score, AD, like what, was defensive player of the year contender early in the season. Yeah. When Giannis felt like scoring, I'm going to score on you. Bully, not, bro. There's no stopping him. Not a person on the jump, planet. Man. <laughs> no. I won't even dunk it, Anthony. <laughs> mm. 
All right, we all familiar with Nate Jones. You know what I'm saying? On Jones that. on Nate is the reason that I've been able to succeed on Twitter. So I pr support his uh, move insoles. For sure, man. All the pair. Oh, hella I'm not getting a bag to, to do this, Nate. Don't even want any. I'll pay my own bread to do it. Chuck, you said if I got a pair too? Yeah. I'm going to get a pair for Hey, show, if you don't got show. move insoles and they're not paying us to do this shit. At all. They got my kneecaps feeling buttery. I'm oh, for real? I'm wow. tapping in. All right, I need to get Three some. Three mile jogs. Like, no, this is no not going to avoid issues. the Hoka curse, bro, because I don't want to be the motherfucker out here wearing Hokas, dog. So huh. give me oh, some bro. Nikes with the move joints in and we hey, good. If you need See, some I, drugs, I, I'm, 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 the Hoka is like, bro, that big beefy so I can't go there. You know what I mean? Brooks are... The design needs some work, but anyway. Yeah, yeah okay. Oh, anyway, anyway yeah. Shorter gentlemen, they'll put the, the joint in to give them an extra two inches and make them look yeah, taller. Yeah. This is what it does for a Robert larger Denny gentleman G. like me. Give me an extra quarter inch. You got me really feeling out here like I'm getting it. There we go. There we go. Sorry. But appreciate you, Nate. Nate was talking about basketball becoming more niche. And he was saying that as we, as like, that's where it's heading. The league is, I know there's a bunch of superstars or like, you know, the young guys are popping off court. They're probably like, like Shea. Shea in the 90s would not have been a superstar probably, right? Not to the extent he is now. Where the kids care, like he has kids buying these fucking Mega Man shoes. Mm. But like, you know what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. the super, the, the kids are making more money, more popular than ever been. You know what I mean? But it's still like people are people watching the games. Like the game itself, it seems like it's becoming more niche. I think. I mean, I, I actually saw something the other night where he's talking about how there's there have been declines in TV ratings, obviously, That's and a Nielsen. lot of we that. Want to go off Nielsen? No, I, I know, but and I think the Who game the fuck is, is Nielsen, bro. And there's and, and, bro, and, and it's a box that you have to have in your house. I'm just saying, and you have so to be probably annoying. like you sound like a hoe ass nigga. Like, oh, I'm calculating shit. <laughs> <dog>. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. I don't, have you ever met anybody with a Nielsen? No. I had a, we rented a house. Yeah. We were moving a bunch and we stayed in this house and they had Nielsen boxes. And it's the only time I've ever. How old you, was the person you rented the house from? Well, so they updated. So it was all our information. Yeah. And when you'd sit down to log in before, like you turn on the TV and there'd be a window and you'd have to like put, put in who it was. Yeah. And then when you'd watch and like an hour later it'd come up. It was so fucking annoying. Do they pay you for this shit? They don't pay us. They pay the lady whose house we were renting over. Oh, wow. Was, but they would send like Straight chocolate porno to channel. the house. Okay. Straight you know, porno channel kid, on our joint. Like, oh, this is tight. <laughs> but anyway. Anyway, yeah. But the point is, I think the TV ratings like for some of those have maybe gone down a bit. I think a lot of illegal streaming helps. And so the game is as popular, if not more popular. I mean, it's, it's more popular than it's ever been. But the point that this person was making was that like, because guys are moving around as much, it's a like player centric league, not a team centric league. So if your player that you like isn't say in a finals or in a game, there's less tying you to watching some of these things. So you watch the player. You're not really a fan of the game because I'm I'm a, I'm gonna watch the finals regardless who's in it. Same. Because I'm a fan of the game. Yeah. But it seems like are there's less though? fans of the game. Are you though? What, what, what do you mean? What do you talk about it? I'm saying you have a boo boo ass finals. There there's some finals where it's like eh, I mean I'll watch it. I'm not I mean, happy. Yeah, but I mean yeah, but I mean, I, we still watch it though. I'm like, not getting I, the heat I feel off, like though. It, the game is the game is more global than it's ever been, right? Yes. You know what I'm saying? Like like I was saying these. The superstars are bigger as far as pop culture, more, you know what I'm saying, than they've ever been. You know what I mean? I feel like that. Yeah. But it's still like, I think the game of basketball, like people aren't watching the game. Like they're not as fans of basketball as much. So, so it kind of leans towards what you were saying, where like people are more fans of the soap opera and what's going on around the game. Yeah. And so like, dog, I remember like, even if you were a fucking skater wearing airwalks and fucking Jinkos, bro, you still was watching basketball. You know what I'm saying? Like, you still was watching MJ and them, and you was like, we was talking about that shit, bro. You know, I don't, I don't, you know, motherfuckers, you know, it might not be the case anymore, G. Like, where people aren't really watching basketball as much and keeping up with the soap opera or what's going on around the game rather than what's on the court. I think he's right in that it's more niche, but I also think, like, oh, obscuring all of this is that we're, like, in a transition state. Like, LeBron, it's not quite his league anymore. You had that run of unbelievable finals where all we staff. wanted was Warriors Cavs, and that shit was awesome every year. Even if it was bad series, you wanted the drama of that finals. And so, you know, it's, it's changing a little bit. We remember watching the league change from when it was MJ's. And then there were kind of those obscure years. That was ugly times. And yeah. I don't think it will be as ugly because there are a lot more stars now than there were then. But, like, it's got to change. Like, the reason that that Cavs, Warriors, those finals were so good is because, like, you watched it every year. And it built towards that. And it's like a TV show where it's like the big bad is there at the end and you get the final bosses that you want to see yes. fighting each other. You yes. know what I'm saying? I'll just say a few things. One NFL, 17 weeks, right? You're locked in Thursday, Sunday, Monday, occasional yeah, yeah, Saturday yeah. game. You know Sunday is your weekend, you're gonna lock into into an NBA 82 games. So our off top, 
I'm not watching all 82 of those motherfuckers. A lot. And Unless a you're a Lakers fan like me, season. watching Spectrum Sports. <laughs> but um, <laughs> you guys watch The Wire, one of my favorite shows. Roger Goodell is like Marlo, right? He's going to mm-hmm. push that pack on you. Mm-hmm. Right, Sleet or Snow. You, right, you, right, you right, 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 right. I don't give a fuck if it's that My on. name's my name type energy. You Where feel Adam me? Silver <laughs> feels more like Hungry Man, feels more like Bodie. Like, find drug dealers in their own right, but they're not moving that Mar- Marlo Greek pack. Mm. He not, he needed Marlo had that one quote. He was like, "You wanted to be one way, but it's the other way." It's the other way. That's how Adam Silver needs to start moving. Dog. I agree. You feel me? But yeah, I'm putting Chris and Snoop it. on the block. Here's, right. here's the thing: like, <laughs> they should cut it to make it 70 games, make it fewer games, make the first few rounds three <laughs> game series. And I get it; like, the TV money is going to need to shift, and it will. Though the problem is, is like you were at the Super Bowl, and like the whole city is taking over. And it is like everything, it feels like, is paying attention to Arizona for the Super Bowl. Where's the Super Bowl? And they have waste management going on. The NFL like said, fuck your corners. There. So, but, fuck your corners, waste management. We're moving our pack on your block. Yeah. <laughs> but so, like, we went to we went to uh, Oakland for the finals. Yeah. Not the same energy. That we were not in Oakland. No. We were in SF. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I tried to slip that well, in. We wish we were in Oakland. Yeah, Close. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want you to get packed up by Bay no, Area. No, no, no. I just Oakland. didn't want, I don't want to give yeah, credit yeah, to yeah. you. Yo, fam. San it's all good. Fuck it's San all good. We were in the home of Rice Aroni. <laughs> but my point is, is like, they make it like a fucking event. And you kind of need to limit, to your point, pull back, make the demand go up. Um, like Three questions. Where Where is the Super Bowl this year? Arizona. Where is it next year? Uh... Vegas. Where is it the year after that? Is it Miami? I think it's New Orleans. New Orleans. Yeah, you're right. But good guess. They're going to make see, sure that city see, pops. Fire, fire, right, fire. But see right, how right, your mind, right. your mind didn't playing. say Cleveland. <laughs> your mind didn't say Salt Lake City. What are we doing? They ain't watering down the pack, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, they making sure. Like, niggas are not trying to go to Salt Lake City. Find place if I want to get some skiing and if I want to hit Sundance. What is I'm, the purpose of that? I'm wondering. Like, what is, why does they, the NBA do that? They try to that? reward all these other teams. Like, look, if you're a small market boo-boo team, just be happy we let you in the game. Bring your ass to Miami. Bring your ass to Las Vegas. We, we could do it in Houston or Dallas. You know where else there is next year, right? Indianapolis. Indianapolis. Yeah, of Decent look? city. Decent city. What's up, Pat McAfee? <laughs> wow. Century located. Good for so, you. Yeah. Good for him, too. Bro, <laughs> I love your brother. Yeah, He's yeah, cool yeah. Of course. Yeah, of course. Yeah, can shake. Funny, bro. White Castle, walking distance. That's all I yeah, got to yeah. say. We don't have a White Castle on walking distance in L.A. <laughs> <laughs> Everything we, is But we're L.A. Again. We don't need a White Castle on walking distance but to Ros- sell the fucking city. Roscoe's fell off, and I tried to defend it on a previous okay, show. I, I appreciate you being honest. I appreciate you being honest, man. I just never... That's not my style of waffle. That like ego flat kind. I like the big fluffy waffle. That's a good waffle too. That yeah, yeah, more yeah. of a Belgian, if you yeah, will. Yeah, more of the Belgian. Really lard. Yeah. Wh- who's the first Belgian nigga? Like, I'm not gonna make pancakes. <laughs> I'm just gonna fucking press it. And then Phil Knight came in. Like, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna make some fucking shoes. Shoot. Whoever yeah, could made like created waffles and donuts. Yeah, bro, donuts, man. crazy. Yeah. Before before we leave. I, I I want to know your guys' thoughts on Ben Simmons. Things have not gone his way. He's now the only man left in Brooklyn. I mean, the, granted, he good guys come in with him, but Can't things are not time, great. Bro. And there are every every day I feel like I see a clip of him getting to the rim and whipping the ball away. They didn't, and, they didn't guard him one time. He scored on that possession, but I, I saw it on the internet. <laughs> Was it real? I just feel bad for I feel <laughs> Just like it said, was it real? <laughs> was, you can't believe your eyes. There was five niggas on defense, Bro. and not one of them said, "I'm gonna guard the person he dribbling said. the ball." <laughs> was it real? I, but I need because I saw the cream at it the other day. We cream oh. beat Bron Shit. That the was day. so <laughs> wholesome, bro. You were you just. It can't be What's, the Ben that I know. Because, like, I, we've seen tweets that are like, he, I don't know how long he stays in the league. I'm, I'm wondering. I'm wondering. That team is not good enough. Ben has been, was a perennial all-star, okay? Yeah. I saw some highlights of Ben Pryor. Like, I was like looking at just old Ben shit. I'm like, God damn. He was, uh, the confidence he played. He has no confidence. He looks stiffer, so maybe it's the back injury. Yeah. But like he's nowhere near the player he was, and a low back injury will do that. You can't – those are unavoidable issues, like a low back. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Things like that. But, like, bro, he's not the same on defense. Remember he was a god on defense? Oh, yeah. Just strapping motherfuckers up. Always in the top three of defensive player of the year. You know what I'm saying? Running. Nowhere near that, I think bro. you're right. The back is probably a huge problem. And I feel bad for him. I also think, like, the league has changed. Like – the way he played and the league hasn't changed years? that much since two years. No, 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 no. Because I mean, it's, no, it's longer than that. You know, but the, the thing about Ben Simmons was 
like he was one of those players that even though he couldn't shoot, he could still affect the game. Yeah, he was going to leave with 16 points, drop you, drop off seven assists, play great defense, and ha- still control the game without a jumper. He was kind of like I won't, I'm not comparing him to Giannis in any sense, but there's some people that are good enough and athletic enough. I'm not, I'm not making that comparison. Good job. That are not good enough. That, 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 that are good enough. You know what I'm saying? That can, can affect the game even though they don't have a jumper. And he was one of those guys. Well, outside of like to your point, Giannis, who. Who, but Giannis is like Giannis is bigger than him, stronger than him. Who that's his size or smaller functions in, in this league today that can't shoot? No, but, but that, that's that's what made him special. Like, okay, remember remember Fultz when he lost his jumper, how it affected Ooh. his game so badly, Pretty, right? Yeah, yeah. And, and and that was one re- thing I was thinking, like when watching the Fultz and then you know seeing seeing Ben is like Ben ain't got a jumper, but he's still affecting the game in so many different play- ways. And it's like wow, like he's one of the guys that is athletic enough because he's a, a guy. He was a god tier athlete, bro. I just think that like like efficiency things and things like efficiency, the way that we scout, the way that teams defend are so angled at like exposing that guy that it's like it kind of took a lot of gas away from Russ. It it feels like it's killed Ben Simmons. It was kind of what like like I feel like Carmelo could probably years ago still have pinged around the league, but the like the long two guys, the guys that aren't necessarily efficient jump shot takers, it the, shit doesn't work the thing out. About Carmelo, Carmelo needs a lot of touches to to be effective. True. And he's not gonna get those touches at this point. Yeah. The thing about right. Russ, Russ's knees, bro. Yeah. When his knees went, his jumper went. He jumps eight eight feet in the air when he shoots. Point. So that's you know what I'm saying? Okay. But the thing with with, ben. with ben, ben was young and he got a lot of his buckets in the open court. You know what I'm saying? Great, great passer, great vision. I mean, he like he doesn't even have the sauce he used to have where he was like was <laughs> nasty with the passes. Like his like I think his back went and with his back, his confidence is Ooh. gone. And I, it is the league is way too good, and I just don't see a guy, you know what I'm saying, that, that stiff as he is, that doesn't have, you know, the, the confidence that can – if you don't have the confidence, how can you play in the league? I it's agree. too competitive. There's 400, what, 450 guys in the league? Yeah. Bro, it's just hard. You, you, you're on a team that's not that good, and you're struggling to get minutes. Mm. Gentlemen, if we may divert for a moment, I'll just ask you to bow your heads. I want to pr- pray to light-skinned basketball Jesus for, for our <laughs> man Ben Simmons. Go God, please help Ben. <laughs> He's getting a beautiful bag. Great A finesse. I don't want to put him on the great A finesse All Stars guy. You know I deal in memes and chicanery. <laughs> I do not want to clown or pack this man up. He's Australian, light skinned. It's it's always a Canadian light skinned or the Australian light skinned. Amen. That was, oh, man. That was, that was, I'm still going. I'm, okay, I'm okay, still okay. diverting off the prayer. prayer. Oh, oh, man, make sure you're back. Back. Yeah, 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 you know, like Thanksgiving had to look around like whose eyes are still open. All right, nigga, I'm about to eat this little piece of turkey because this shit is going too long. But God, please help Ben out, man. We do not want to pack this man up. We like him. Okay, we appreciate him finessing bags. Got out of Philly, got to Brooklyn. Josiah needs the help. And I don't like saying Josiah because it sounds too much like Josiah. So I'm just going to call him Cy. Okay. From this point forward. Let's get to basketball, Jesus. Amen. 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 God damn, that. Ben. All right. I think that's good to end on. I think, I think, I think you rap. I think, I think that's the show, man. That's right great. there. You know what I'm saying? All right. I'm the Jethro Jenkins. Josiah Jeff. <laughs> Energy. I'm trying to bring energy. I've, I've been watching videos like the Joe side. That thing doesn't work. Energy. I'm Zach Schwartz. Every episode drops on Tuesdays. You can watch it on YouTube. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Comment on the video. Like the video as always. And if you want to listen to this, you can get it wherever you get your podcasts. Spotify, iTunes. Make sure to subscribe there as well. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you.